clothes. That's about as quick as I've ever seen the plant doing that. Ooh, Look at that. Wow, that one really be. I wonder how long it takes to recover. Uh, thank you for joining us this morning for our class on plants with the Science Castle. And of course, you need to visit our website at www.sciencecastle.com. Plants. plants are living things, a lot like you and I, but also very different from you and I. What do plants do that is very special that people What's and animals have to do with us? We need it to make muscles, we need it to grow, we need it to make new cells. They, they can also grow out of their roots, and we're going to do an experiment later on today about that because they don't necessarily need... Now that you know a little bit about the plants, let's talk about our science story today. Shut that alarm clock off and he stops and looks. And that morning, there was a mouse sitting on his alarm clock, eating his peanut butter and jelly sandwich that he had left. We gotta get out of here, what are we gonna do? Well, what are they gonna do? That part's up to you. We're gonna do a couple of experiments here and you should have your science kits ready that you got in the mail when you signed up for the class. And we're going to show you some of these experiments. And in these experiments are probably a couple of answers to help solve Mike and Maxie's dilemma. What else is in our kit? A real cool piece of lab equipment. This is really lab equipment, guys. This is called a pipette. Now what are we going to do with this? We put some water in the dishes. Got some water right here in the top, in, on the paper towel, on both of them. That's about enough. Because what you're going to do is you're going to put the star over the top of the seeds and put it in the light. Also, remember, come back to www.sciencecastle.com and these experiments, as we have them progress here, will be posted out on the website. And you're going to take that bag and just put it right around that leaf and be very careful not to hurt it or break the leaf off. Okay? And leave it alone and watch what happens. Put them in a nice place where you think the plant will be happy. Measure the results on how long it takes for results. But look what we have here. We mixed up some blue and our flower is starting to change colors. After a couple of days, again, recording your results like a good scientist, you can find out how thirsty that plant is over the course of an hour or a day or a couple of days. We just want to watch about the color here and the water transfer. After a couple of hours or days, and again, you're going to have to tell us how long it took. This is empty when you start, but drip your strings over to the other side, and this is what happens. Again, be sure to check out the results of our experiments on the website and we'll post these as they happen and you'll be able to find if your experiment is doing a predictable thing or maybe if you're lucky you might discover something new. So let's finish up for the day and let's go back and visit Mike and Maxie again. When we left them, you might recall, that they were in a pretty perilous situation. They were stuck in a room with roots and leaves and no way out. Absolutely. Well, eventually, the good news is that they do get out. But it's up to you to tell us how they did it.